everybody. Welcome back to EA Sports. I'm James Tobolsky. These rosters are absolutely loaded. Filthy amount of talent. Let's see what's in store for this hunt matchup. We are about set to drop the puck as both centers make their way into the dock. The Red Wings get off to a good start as they win the opening faceoff. Takes the puck into the corner of the offensive end. Blocked in front. Moltzett's moving the puck through his own zone. Quick pass to Hughes. The Red Wings played along the wing. There he is from the slot. Oh, and that one pumps up short as he just gets enough of that one. Under siege and finally grabs that one and covers up for a whistle. Hughes is respected by his teammates, and they just love to see him succeed, guys. He's got that four-leader zone ability, which means he gives them a huge boost every time he scores. McDavid's won the draw, and they'll look to set up. Detroit's got a hold of it against the wall. Puck sent over to Maltzev. Good read with the stick to break that up. Takes the feed in the middle of the neutral zone. Cuts into the paint. Stopped by the goaltender. That's a great save. Oh, he saved it! Scores! They came, they saw, they took advantage of the rebound and score. Oh, he burns the goaltender on that one. Picks up the rebound and buries it home. Goalie looks frustrated now. James knows that you got to redirect that puck to a safe spot. The Red Wings were looking for a good start in this one, and they have certainly accomplished that with the first goal of the game just minutes in. Well, you know they would have talked about making sure that they established some presence and some pace in the game, in particular in the opening frame, James. But to get up a 1-0 score! That's fast, James. A pair of goals in 40 seconds. Cheryl, you stress consistently. Keep your feet moving on the ice, and that pays off. Well, they got the pedal to the metal right now. They're like a freight train. Lots of time left in this period. The Red Wings have recently taken a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. Quick feed to Nurse. Moves the puck behind the net. Oh, he made the save! How did he stop it? I have no idea, James. I mean, he was down and out, but profound athleticism and desperation got him back in to make it. Such an impressive save. Love looking at this one again, James. You know that this goaltender is dialed in so focused when they're doing everything to get to the puck and keep their opponent at bay. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period, the Red Wings are currently sitting in the driver's seat leading 2-0. Gretzky's won the draw. Played big in the moment there. Scores! That's three in a row! when you're running in the game and your opponent is chasing and that's exactly what's happening right now. Backhands can be so difficult for the goaltender to read and she does a great job of getting that up high while the goalie's down low. Excellent goal. The Red Wings have been all over them and there's still plenty of time left in this first. Gretzky's won the draw at center. Pasternak's got it in the offensive zone. Makes a move in front. Blocked in traffic. Zizekas carries it through the neutral zone. Dumps it in. The Red Wings gain possession. Looking dangerous as they move along the boards. Moves the puck along the half wall. No room for that one to get through. Nurse is going to play it from the back of the cage. And he kicks the net. He scores! Talk about staying with the play. Well, it's all about being strong. You have to have that center of gravity, but you also have to have a lot of core strength to be able to ward off your opponent and shield the puck like he did. And as a result, it winds up in the back of the net. 
as a defender, it is so difficult to defend against power and strength. You combine that with a little bit of leverage and shielding of the puck, and man, you can be in trouble. As evident right here as he drives the net and finishes it off with the goal. Ajo's won the draw here in the open ice. Into the corner now. Hammers it off net. Turned aside with the glove by Sandstrom. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. The Red Wings have added to their lead. They're now up by four. And they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Goaltender covers up and will get a face off. The Red Wings continue to lead midway through the first. They have really put on an offensive clinic so far. Ajo's won the draw here and they'll go on the attack. His reflexes on display tonight. Well, you know that he's a fierce competitor, and he battled to make consecutive saves there, James. The Red Wings are dominating in almost every facet of the game here in the first. Ajo's oh, got it. Now they'll look to see what they can do with it offensively. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. Past the halfway mark of this period, the Red Wings came out with jump, and they have been non-stop right from the start, leading 4-0. Ajo's got it, and it scores another one, and listen to these fans now, Cheryl, they don't like it one bit. Oh, they don't like it, James. It is ugly inside the building. You couldn't get anything going on the ice, and even harder when your own fans are booing. You need no look any further than the leader on this team who buries it home. I mean, he has got ice in his veins, and he knows the timing. When his team needs something, they look to him, and he answers. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Ajo's quick stick lands with the puck here at center. Shot! Too many bodies in the way. Slip feed. Gains the zone from the right. The Red Wings scoop it up along the boards. Matthews takes it into the offensive end. Drives it to the crease. Denies him with the pad. And they'll get a breather as the goaltender covers it up. And they win the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. He was locked in there. Oh, the bench gets such a boost when he scores, so that's such a timely stop by the goaltender. Doesn't allow any energy to be created. Heads deep inside the offensive zone. And that caroms off a body in the lane. Sizikas takes the puck. Moves it quickly over to Mata. Here's a shot. Oh, and somehow he gets a sliver of it and keeps them at bay. As a defender, you... Oh, scores! There's multiple layers to this goal. Not only is it tough to bat out of the air, you have to have good sense of timing and hand-eye coordination, but you also have to have an awareness of where that puck is and where you're making contact with it, because guess what? If it's above the crossbar, this is a no-goal. The Red Wings have outshot, outscored, and all around dominated here in this first. Gretzky's gained possession inside the neutral zone. The Red Wings carry it along the wall. Here's a rocket of a shot. And they'll cover it up, forcing a stoppage in play. The Red Wings have been the better team so far in this first period. They've had multiple scoring opportunities, and as a result, have the lead. Gretzky's won the faceoff here in the offensive zone. Drives to the sweet spot. Stopped by the goaltender. Oh, what a save! He stopped it! Wow! Oh, that's an intangible effort that you can't teach, James. That's all about desperation and the will to stop that puck. How did he stop that one? I'm not sure how he kept up to that shot right from the slot area, James. But, man, he flashed the leather. He made the save. No rebound to boot. Officials ready to drop the puck and get things back underway. The Red Wings will start off on the attack after winning the draw. Scores! And look who's at it again! Oh, 
First 20 minutes of play. We've got lots more still to come. Second period action next, right here. through the first 20 minutes played. The Red Wings were ready to play right from puck top, James. They put their opponent on their heels. They dictated pace, and in particular, they managed the puck in own possession time. That's great. You still have to finish, and they did it, and they've got a healthy lead. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. The Red Wings win the faceoff. There's the whistle as the puck goes up and over the glass. The Red Wings have dominated them thus far and continue to do so here in this second. McDavis won the faceoff deep. He scores! And there's the hat trick. Three is the magic number. It's a magic number. He's doing everything he can to take the crowd out of this one as he's with the away team, but he's been dominated, playing really confident all night long. I don't know why players don't take this shot more often, James. I mean, the back end, it is so difficult for the goaltender to read. The Red Wings are checking all the boxes here tonight, Cheryl. I mean, look at the score. I mean, from all facets of the game, too. Well, let's look at the offensive zone. I mean, they're getting the majority of the shots, but there's a big fat zero on their opponent's side. Why? Because their goaltender's been outstanding, and they've been in good defensive posture. Definitely seeing everything. And a good save on the play as action continues. Mata's got it across the line. Tries to the crease. Reaches out and pokes it away. Grubauer has been able to watch the game for most of the night from the other end because of the offensive production in the offensive zone, James. But he's a real good job there. Timing is everything. Staying focused, tracking the puck, and making a good save at the right time. Looks Rush. like we got a penalty coming up here. Molsek's got it along the wing. There's the whistle, and here's the call. Well, the game is played at such fast rate that sometimes you want to slow your opponent down, but if you take too much ice, it's going to be an interference call. Both teams lining up for the face off, and it's a chance to see if there's actually some power in this power play. First power play opportunity for this team. It's going to start in the face-off circle, getting possession with the win, and then looking to set up. Nice play, shorthanded as they get control of the puck. Driving right to the front. Oh, big time save by Sandstrom. Now the shooter's going to run out of real estate because he does a great job of getting out of top of the crease and taking away all the room. When you make yourself as big as possible, there's less holes in the net. Ajo's ready for the draws. They will continue to try to kill off this penalty. 
And now it's grabbed by Dowdy. Why? You're in the slot, you gotta hit the net. The Red Wings gain control of the puck against the wall. And the puck stopper hangs on to get a breather here for the team. Special teams so important. Can they capitalize on this power play here with a face-off? The Red Wings take possession here inside the offensive zone. Picked up along the boards by Pasternak. Detroit's got it in their own zone. Here they come. Right through center and into the offensive zone. Fires it. Oh, and he's somehow got a little piece of it, and it stays out of the net. Well, that wrister had some heat, James, but he was able to get in front of it and turn it aside. And he shuts the door again. What a great job of tracking the puck up. One but two consecutive saves. The Red Wings have been putting lots of shots on net and have been rewarded for their efforts. Detroit's got possession here in their own end. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. We got a delayed penalty coming up. That trip right in front of the official's eyes. Can't get away with that. The Red Wings are going to serve two for tripping here. Detroit's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. They haven't scored yet in the game on the power play, but no need to get frustrated. They all bring a different skill set. It's the reason why they're out there. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. He's got a step! Oh, what a fantastic save there! Oh, he's got such quick hands, but he's in tight. And when you move them fast, you don't force them to move. And the goaltender is able to read it, track it, and make the save. Solid hit on the play, and that knocks the puck off his stick. Into the attacking end. Shot! Oh, a clutch save! And that somehow stayed out of the net. Shattenkirk stick handling in his own zone. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. Fires it on net! That's denied by the goaltender. The Red Wings move the puck in the defensive zone. Offside the call, we'll get a face-off coming up. Well, you could feel this coming, here they go. Yeah, they were coming towards one another and you knew it was gonna happen. And both of the benches are elevated standing up as this one's going on. And there's the winning blow. Did he ever connect on that one, James? And now look at him on the ice, he's laboring to get up. James, this fight is a product of frustration. You're getting blown out in the game, but you have lots of runway left. You're just trying to spark someone, get something going, and see if you can generate some momentum. Another face-off looming here on this power play. Uh, okay, one right here. Gretzky's gained possession, and his great work inside the face-off circle pays off again. The Red Wings makes the save. And this is a great save. You can see this one-on-one -on -one battle. And that goaltender is so dialed in, tracking and makes that save. Shot! Long jam in front, that's broken up. The Red Wings are in transition. To the low slot, gives them nothing in front. Snaps it out of the net, and that goes off a player in front. Here's a chance. Goalie with a stop. Well, this save looks easier than it actually is. I mean, when you have a shooter right in the slot and you know that you've got to find a way to get your glove on it, you got to be fast, you got to be quick and show those reflexes, he does that and makes the save. And off the draw, they'll take possession. The Red Wings will play it in their own end. And it's a quick pass to Maltzev. And that's stolen by McDavid. The Red Wings have been the better team tonight by far. I mean, this is coming right off of without the puck. They know when to play. Oh!
love this snapshot from in tight James that beats the goaltender, but how about the will to get to those tough areas? I mean, that's what it's all about. You can have the skill, but you've got to have the will. The Red Wings continue to hammer the accelerator here in the offensive zone tonight. They've been incredible almost through two periods of play here, and I mean, their ozone possession time is dictating it all. The ability to get to the net, and of course the motion on the outside, which is disrupting the coverage and opening up the lanes. Well saved made by Sandstrom. The Red Wings have been on fire offensively tonight, and they lead for good reason here in the second. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Detroit's got the puck along the wall. Can't stay on his feet after that hit. Through center along the wing. Slides the puck over. The Red Wings gain possession along the wall. And that stays out as he got just enough of the puck with the glove. And play continues. The Red Wings with a total team effort to this point as they lead comfortably here in the second. Ajo's won the draw and they'll look to set up. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Sandstrom. Love the way the goaltender gets tight to the shooter here. The puck's in the low slot. You want to take away time, you want to take space. Goaltender does it, makes the save. Detroit's looking to break out of their own end. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. The Red Wings have it now. Feeds the puck to Ajo. Here's a chance. Oh, and a great save by Sandstrom. Scores! At the buzzer, and they get one. Well, coaches always say the first minute and the last minute of every period are critical. Well, now they've got momentum heading into the next frame. they got to carry it forward. That's a hard shot. The goaltender looks like he's just getting to position, gets a piece of it, but it still goes in. The Red Wings are showing no signs of slowing down, and here we are in the late stages of period number two. They continue to hit down the accelerator. Yeah, and the coach must be loving this. I mean, sometimes you can't put your finger on exactly why it's working the way it is, but the chemistry is off the charts here, and they've got a comfortable lead. the horn 40 minutes in the books we'll get a refresh for both the players ice back with a third period next so far. Detroit's got to get the puck, James. I mean, to put it in layman's term, one, you got to get the puck, two, you got to score. They're not doing either. The Red Wings will play it against the wall. Oh, what a slick stop by Sandstrom. Well, this is a really great save, James. I mean, you can see that he's battling for position. He scores! Talk about staying with the play as he puts in his own rebound. This is a pounder goal if I ever scored one, but I love his ability to drive, and he gets the original shot off. This is Imposing your will on the opponent, just blasting through everyone, getting your own rebound to get the ball. The Red Wings probably don't want this game to end the way things have gone here. And I know we're in period number three, but Cheryl, what a night. Yeah, it's been terrific right from puck talk. And they've been consistent throughout the game. And consistency is always a word that coaches talk about. And if they can finish this off with this nice lead, that's the word the coach is going to be preaching after the game. Kucherov's gonna play it against the half wall. Moves inside! Scores! And that's three! It's a hat trick here on the road! Well, old hat for 
Dean is looking back and finding a way to take away his eyes. Does a great job, and the puck goes in. The Red Wings are sending a clear message that they are not taking their foot off the gas in this third period here, Cheryl. Well, you can certainly tell that they bought into the game plan, and the coach is certainly ecstatic with the performance of the entire bench. I mean, look at the way they're moving and holding the puck, attacking the net at the right times. It has been a seamless effort. Redirected off a stick. Grabbed along the boards by Nurse. That goes off the post and stays out. The Red Wings have a big lead here. They've been dominating possession. Everything's about habit, being aggressive, staying on the puck. But you know that they always want to put it in, and this one just wires off the frame. Picked up along the wall by Nurse. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Stopped by the goaltender. Here's the chance. Oh, great stop. Taken along the wall by Gretzky. Yes. Stones him in front. And he's going to slow things down and hang on for the whistle and the fans on their feet. Myazzi covers up. Everyone knows the save that he just made and the opportunity he presented for his team and everyone giving a standing ovation. Ajo's got the puck and they'll go on the attack. And we'll get a reset after the puck goes up and out of play. The Red Wings can simply take this on cruise control based on the lead that they now have here in the third. And they win the faceoff and set up to go on the attack. Puts it on net, and that goes off a body. Great four check by Matthews. Cuts to the paint, decides to think about it. Wrist shot from the slot, and that got cut up in traffic and goes up the stick. Goaltenders work so much on their reaction time, and man, this is just a clinic right now as he flashes the glove and makes the save. The Red Wings have shown no signs of stopping putting pucks on net, and they lead it here in this third. Nowhere for that shot to go through. And not much on that one. Oh, there's one more. I'm not sure where the defense is, but I'll tell you what, the goaltender has been outstanding, made a flurry of saves to keep his team in this one. Dumps it into the Ozone. Here's a short pass to Ajo. Moves it around along the half wall. Takes it into the slot. Oh, spectacular save on the play. Here he is with the backhander. And he scores. I think he makes a really good read here, James. He anticipates the play well and gets himself square to the shooter, but unfortunately, this one hits him and he seems to be a little leaky because it finds its way to the back of the net. The Red Wings are having themselves a night. They probably don't want this one to end, Pounder. Nah, I wouldn't. If you're patting the stats and you're putting up these kind of numbers, I mean, from start to finish, they've imposed their will on their opponent. Try sight has got the puck. The Red Wings offense has been the story tonight as they continue to lead big time in the third. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. The Red Wings take possession in the defensive end. The Red Wings have it from the corner. Takes it to the net. Denies it in front. Man, he was right on that puck. He knew exactly where it was. It was tight to the crease. He got out and challenged right away to make the save. Detroit's moving it up the ice. Change up, change up. And that's knocked away by Doughty. Moves it to Kucherov. With possession along the wall. Rips it. Oh, and he gets a piece of the puck to deny them there. I don't think anybody was hanging on to the puck after that hit. Continue to attack the net here in period number. 
in all areas of the game that have really been terrific tonight, James. I've also enjoyed the communication that we're seeing on the ice, not just the body language, but also the vocalness. I mean, they're creating all over the ice, and it's been real fun to watch. Taken by Gretzky. The Red Wings take it along the wall. Quick shot, and that carries off a stick. Moves the puck over to Ashton. Less than 60 seconds to play in this blowout. From the right wing, he moves it to the middle. Takes the shot, and that one's stopped. There's the whistle. We get a face-off after the goalie covers up. The Red Wings have pummeled their opponents tonight. They have been the busier team offensively and have converted numerous times here in this third period. Off the draw, they take possession. Down the left wing and into the offensive zone. Stopped by the goaltender. Oh, it stops again. He's the one that scores. That's what you call having a knack for the net, James. When you get in tight and you're sniffing around, you better get that puck off quickly because you know there are defenders all around you that are going to come and close. The Red Wings are looking to protect the lead here late in this third period as they have been the dominant offensive club. The Red Wings win it. Cheryl picking up that shutout. Yeah, and it was a tough one as well. A lot of shots came his way, but really aggressive. Got to the top of his crease. Excellent job. on the ice and I can't wait to do it again. I know you can't wait either. So we'll see you next time and real soon at that.